morning guys welcome to today if I'm i have excited. dirt on me it's because i've been in the garden gardens are made to make people sane to keep people sane gardens are amazing so i know i wanted to tell you guys that i know i told you the other day that macy's not doing so well and i wanted to share with you guys that she has some congestive heart failure and she's really stuffed up and really fluidly and has trouble breathing sometimes. She's old, she's 13 and she's getting frail. I told you guys that before. She's just not as well as she should be. And it makes me sad to see her failing because we've had her since she was 12 weeks old and she is such a part of me. She is such a part of me and she was such a part of Gabby and it's gonna be sad to say goodbye, but we will be saying goodbye soon for her. And I can't bring myself to do it yet, so I don't have any plans, but it will be this summer. It will be soon. She seems young. Just to look at her and see her, but when my nephews were here the other day, she, they were telling me, oh, this dog is very old. Like, you can tell that she's, she's not doing so well. This dog, on the other hand, is super young, and I'm not saying that Flippantly, I'm just telling you guys like this this I've cried already tears about her and I've cried already about that That's a decision that we have to make soon and and but we're not there yet And I'm not making it yet and that day will be a, I'll be a basket case But I'm just telling you and I'm preparing you and the reason I'm telling you and preparing you is because there are a lot of young Children that watch our channel and message me every day and say where are the chihuahuas? <laughs> so Anyways, I'm just keeping you up to date, but it's not that time yet. It's not, I'm not dealing with that today. I'm not dealing with that today. Instead, I'm dealing with this girl. Whoa, who knows she's not allowed on the couch and has never gone on the couch in her life. <laughs> what is happening? What is happening? You better get down, Missy. Off. Oh, that hurt. Off. Okay, so I stood up off my bed when I heard Daisy running up the stairs. So she jumps right from my head. Yeah, I know. And I get terrified. <laughs> I know. And then she literally jumps on top of me. I'm like, I'm standing. Why? It's true. The house was quiet and calm, and I pick up the camera, and it gets crazy. Off. Ruby, off. I'm sorry. You guys are not allowed on the couch. Daisy is not allowed on the couch either, but She's Daisy. on the couch 24-7. <laughs> no. She's either in her cage, playing with her rocks, or on the couch. Yeah, it's true. It is true. But anyways, welcome to today. Today is the first day of summer vacation for us. It's the first day. I'm just packing up school, getting things done. I just finished signing Gabby up for Trillium. Look how excited they are. It's there. official. It's official. Gabby's going to Trillium. It's scary. It's official. She's going to the very first Trillium show. There are only three shows this season because of because of COVID. So she signed up and she's going. <laughs> next weekend not this saturday but next saturday is trillium comment down below if you've ever taped your pop socket to your phone comment below if you've ever taped a pop socket to your it phone it works but there are no comments right now go on instagram <laughs> don't send them to instagram my instagram is flooded go to tiktok go to sophie go to sophie's instagram go to sophie's tiktok go to sophie yeah i need more followers please go please go what is your tiktok um, Finn and Sophie. Finn and Sophie. I have 8,000 followers right now. Yeah, and that's amazing. And she did it all herself, you guys. And after I get home from the dollar store, I'm going to do a fidget haul, if I remember. But I'm probably going to do it in the car, because I open everything in the car. I just rip it open as soon as I get it. Yeah, I do it too. Uh, there's my TikTok. How many? 8,175. Mares happily having food. Garden happily having a drink. I just came down to turn off the water, but I wanted you guys to see no weeds in my garden. Well, very little weeds in my garden. All doing so good. Horse trailer still being prepared for show. Gabby's getting ready to go uh, shopping with Kaylee. We still don't have our malls open, but there are some stores that have like an outdoor access and outside access, and anybody that any store that has an outdoor access uh, is open. So Kaylee's, Gabby's going with Kaylee to get raincoats for the weekend because let me tell ya, it's supposed to rain. You guys remember the show that we went to recently? This year, I don't even know how we got to go to that show, but we went to a show and it was pouring rain, pouring rain. 
We were hardly prepared for the rain of that show. Remember the show we just went to recently and you had to stand out in the rain with the storm? Yeah, well you guys would be standing out in the rain this time. No, I'll be with the girls. You three horses to stand so, out in the rain. So, yeah. Normally when we go to a show, Sam stays, Sam stays at the trailer and watches the horses. And normally I stay far away from there so that he can't complain to me. So I have the walkie-talkie to complain to you. Yeah, so now he's got the walkie-talkie. So now I will not be able to get away from Sam complaining to me saying, come back! Storm is throwing a fit, but Storm won't be at this show. Last night you will have seen the video of Storm's new rider. And I know you guys probably all have a lot of thoughts about it, but I just want you guys to know that hopefully Chanel will be riding Storm and learning to jump on Storm. And Joy wants to continue having lessons on Storm. And so she'll just be having a once a week lesson on Storm with Fiona there to help her and to learn. She needs to advance. And so I think Storm's the horse to help her advance. She doesn't know Storm yet. It was her first ride. It was her first lesson. And he was doing that awkward jump. She has to learn how to get him to jump over the jump perfectly. And she likes him. She felt comfortable because that's the thing. That's the thing is that she felt like he, she felt safe on him and that was important to her. Some people were worried that it's taking too long. So he's taking too long to advance on Finn and, and, and that might be for some people. If somebody was like 14 and still struggling to advance on Finn, then I might think that too. But here's the thing. My girls don't really start to develop as horse people until they're 11 and 12. Like, Sophie's just starting to come into her horse sense before that. And I believe it is with many people because I've seen it at the horse schools. Before a certain level of development, all horse riders, most horse riders, maintain a certain level of of riding and Sophie's just starting she's just starting to get into that she's just starting to take charge of her her power you guys remember Sophie was at this Gabby was at the same level of Sophie at the same age and then all of a sudden when Gabby was like 11 and a half actually 11 and a half exactly she started to come into her power she started to feel feel more strong she started to feel more safe and she started to develop more by the time Sophie is 14 her and Finn let me tell ya it's gonna, it's gonna happen, you guys. You have to believe it, and you have to see what you wanna believe. So, Sophie is gonna be riding Sparky, and he's gonna get her confidence up, because that's what he does, and then she's gonna be learning the basics with Finn. Finn and her are gonna be learning the basics together, and Brandon is gonna be riding Finn, and I'm telling you, I'm covering all the bases. It's not like I'm just sitting there doing nothing for Finn, and nothing for Sophie. Sophie is the right rider for Finn. I know it, I believe it, she believes it, he believes it, so that's what we're going with. But right now, where we're going, where are we going, Sam? We're gonna buy a cheap rain jacket at the dollar store. He's gonna go get a rain jacket at the dollar store. You guys remember we did that before? I don't know, maybe we should go and look for raincoats too because I don't wanna be wet at the show. So she meat knows. shopper girl. I always call Gabby stuff, meat shopper girl. This girl can shop. She always has her own cart. Oh, that is so cute. Oh, that is so cute. I got these because these are delicious. Popcorn. Aha. Uh -huh. Delicious too. And delicious too. And delicious too. Okay, three things, Sophie. No. Oh, I found them. Oh, I got that too. Because we always need knives for the bar. For the bar. You should get one for Gabby. Yeah, I'm gonna get one for Gabby. Uh, listen, three treats. You're not having all those treats. Not happening. All right, dude, so I just ran into Sophie again. Oh, there's all the glue, Sophie. I know, I'm gonna get some. Like, what is that? Wait, glow in the dark? It has to be Elmer's. And this one is, I don't even know. All right, well, there's your Elmer's glue. So did you get back down to three treats? Why are you getting this? Because I need that for riding. It's a giant jug. That's cute. All right, three treats, right? Yep. So I'm gonna show you guys what I'm getting, so getting this file folder in Chino's color to keep all his show papers in it and some laminating stuff that I'll show you later. So Sophie and I are in another store. I literally love these little sneakers. I love them. I love these. Look at how adorable. I should get those. You like the black ones, the slip-on ones? Why don't you get those? We need new shoes, Sophie. I also like these ones. The problem with canvas and, and horses, though, 
dirt just sinks right into it. Well, unfortunately, these do not coincide with horse life. And since, well, I know, but these ones don't either. These are cute. It's a football thing. Yeah, I love the thing where you put your toe in it. I love those. Sophie loves these. Well, you need a pair. So I stole the idea from Gabby. These are the, this is the store she's going to, but she's going to one in a different town. And so we came. Yeah, I like those too. Sophie and I love this color. I'd have this and I'd keep this on them. Th those are $100, so you need to really want them if you want to buy them. Do. You want them? They don't have her size. Darn it. What about these? They're black. Skechers, I love Skechers. No. She wants sneaker balls. Do you know what those are for? Um, so they can be Heelys. So they can put them in your sneakers to take the stink out. You still want them? No. So here's black with green. These. I know, but white. Look at these. But I, I like That's the white ones too. I like the white ones. So she likes these ones. These are Which really one? hard though, I don't know. Find out if they have your size. Try them on. I don't have socks. I'll buy a pair of socks. Have you ever had to do that? Go into a store and then buy socks so you can try on shoes? Yeah, that's what we're doing today. I'm yeah, go ahead. Just don't rip the price tag. I want those ones. So Sophie fell in love with two pairs. These ones have rose gold on them and they're all white. And they're quilted. They're quilted. And then she liked the... Other ones? The... Too. She found it. She went off on her own. Found a raincoat. Is it actually a raincoat though? Mm -hmm. Does it say raincoat? I like it. 50% off. I like it even more. Alright, so so we got a raincoat and I have a raincoat at home that I love. It's blue. You guys see me wear it all the time. I don't know how good it is though. Like it's supposed to pour at this show. Like pour. Anyways, we all have raincoats. We're ready to go. Do we have rain boots? That's the question. Do you have rain boots? I have my giant boots. Yeah, she's got her giant boots. All right, we are set. So probably going to be that Gabby and Kaylee are going to go to the same store and they're all going to end up with the exact same raincoat. <laughs> I, I, but everybody I will know our group at the horse show. They'll all be like, I know you're a part of the day by day group because you all have the same coat. So Sam just told me he got scammed. I don't know what happened. We're gonna see it together. I turned on the phone. Cause who doesn't like a good scam? I ordered something online and it said it was a, it was an ice machine. And it showed a picture of an ice machine. You put water in it and it makes ice. And it's for the counter. Countertop ice machine, cause who loves ice? Yeah, because I figure, well, we're gonna make ice this summer, right? Yeah, cause we're gonna need yeah. ice. And I'm so excited. So I got in the mail, finally, all the way from China, I guess. A nice... This is the ice machine! How much did you pay for it? I don't know, now I have to check to see what I paid for this thing and return it or something. <laughs> no, it's cute, some people love it. I thought I thought it was a poppet. I'm like, is it a poppet? <laughs> and then I look at the tag. It says ice machine. <laughs> That's not an ice machine. It's an ice maker tray. That's why I stopped ordering off of Wish because it's not real stuff. But that that's hilarious. I love it. A countertop. At least they gave me a return envelope. And they must have known. Return and refund policy. Take you 17 years to get it back there, though. I'll probably never get back there. Yeah. It says ice maker on the thing. It is an ice maker, though. It's not worth $20, though, for that. $20? You could buy 10 of these at the dollar store for a dollar. Yeah. It was $20. You paid $20 for an ice machine. Okay, now I have to spread this around and go tell all my friends. <laughs> this is I'm funny. I'm going to return that and see how fast I get the money back. He's going to show it to us. This is what I ordered. This ice <laughs> machine. Nugget ice maker. Nugget ice maker. $27. $30 and he got that little thing. Let me take a picture of that. <laughs> Why would I pay original $77 for an ice machine? Yeah, you got and scammed. And get a tray that you I can make scammed. You got scammed. You got scammed. So I actually do think of my dog. I got her these, but Molly loves them. My dog's a sad right now though. 
I got her these sweet potato dog treats. Yeah, every store we go to, Sophie looks for treats. Because she's really hard, because she has no treats. Because she's a Dalmatian. Yeah, Dalmatians are, need like special Why are you stuff. staring into my eyes? She's oh, like, she just burped something. She's like, they're for me. All right, let's smell them. I hate sweet potato, so. Oh, even Macy wants one. Oh, watch out. I'll give you one after, Macy. You might have to break it for her. She can't eat it. Yeah. She actually likes them. She likes them. She likes them. Jeez, Macy. <laughs> She's like, give me more. That's See if Daisy one. approves. Ruby, get. Make her do some tricks. Good girl. Yeah. Yeah. She's like, I want the treat. Down. They're all going down. Look at they're all laying. Oh, you didn't make her do it. She runs away. Yeah, she Daisy always goes over the there. Toy I bought her. Oh, she hates the toy? She hates every toy I buy her. She likes the ones Gabby buys. Oh. All right, so we're here at the barn. I'm, I'm going to bring the barn, y'all, just in case I need Okay, it. so this is the plan, you guys. This is what's happening. So Gabby is having a lesson with Brandon. Brandon's going to start training Finn next week because Sophie's showing him on Saturday, and if Brandon rides him, he's going to change, and then Sophie's going to feel uncomfortable she knows Finn she knows the way he is now she's gonna need to learn to ride him differently when Brandon changes him so we decided to start that next week today Sophie's not having a lesson she's just riding and practicing her quiet and she's not gonna use a martingale because yeah so let's do it let's Bend the door on me let's do it all right we got oh Finny fancy Finny Fancy Finny. And we got Storm and Gabby. Gabby got a raincoat today and we went to the store. Did you go to the store you were gonna go to? Mm -hmm. And you didn't find any? Not one. Um, Marksburg Warehouse? No, they had none. They had none? none? We found them. Sophie got one. Sophie got one there. But anyway, she went to a secondhand store with Kaylee and they both got really nice uh, raincoats. So all worked out. Huh. Famous last words, Fiona and Sophie just walks up and says, how was that, Brandon? And Brandon said, what'd you say, Brandon? Better. Better. Oh, here's the thing. Brandon said you were doing better. You know? I know! That's a Isn't shocker. Isn't that awesome? I know, Finny. You did amazing <laughs> things, Finny. My horse hates me. <laughs> I wonder if it's because you're sitting on his butt. <laughs> You love her. Oh, he's like, what is happening? And his ears right back to your butt. So, lesson. Or Sophie wasn't having a lesson. She was just riding. Was it good, bad, or ugly? Awesome. Awesome. Good, bad, or ugly, Gabby? Aw. Oh. Aw. Oh, it was good, and it was bad, and it was ugly. Don't you know that you're beautiful?